I am here in my kitchen, Soothe the Press, with my dear, dear friend Robin. And this is kind of, it's not totally a joke about this, because you can see this gorgeous um, cake that she made for me, but this is one of her hobbies that she started. And I get that, hobby. And she self-taught herself how to do all these things. And I was jokingly told her, I said, now, I, she kept making cakes for everybody else. And, and I'd say, I want a cake. She was making a cake for this person or that person. And she never would make me a cake. And then finally, I told her, I said, I know what I want for my birthday. I want one of your cakes. Look what she walked in this morning with. This is my friend Robin. Hello. <laughs> and many of you know Robin because she grew up in Mount Olive and she now lives in Hasburg with the most wonderful girls the name Bert. Yes. And he really is wonderful. But I, Robin, I want you to tell me really a little bit how you got into your cake doing. Well, I've, I've always enjoyed doing it from when I was young, as far back as I can remember. But um, just recently, I had ordered a couple cakes from a lady in Hattiesburg, and they were fabulous cakes. They tasted wonderful. The design was beautiful. So I kind of got back into it, doing a little bit here and there. And so I've just been practicing. You know, I don't really practice a whole lot because I don't make a whole lot of cakes. So if I could do it every week, that would be wonderful, and maybe I would get better. But, um, so, you know, I just do it as I can and, and a little bit at a time. And mainly I've been focusing on the taste of the cake with a little bit emphasis on the design, you know, and the fondant flowers and this and that. But, so, so you know, this is the one that I came up with for you today that matches your <laughs> My bag, my bag. Y'all will have to see it does. It matches my bag. Y'all probably have the whole camera but. But what's funny to me is Robin's standing here saying, I don't practice because I don't have many, look how cute that is with that bag, is that not precious? But I'm afraid she's going to be getting phone calls. <laughs> No, so, do not do it for the public because I'm not there yet. <laughs> but, why do you think you're not there yet? I, I'm um, serious because well, it looks fabulous. I mean, mainly the taste. It's not as consistent as I would like it to be as far as the taste, the flavor of the cake. Um, so that's really kind of it. And I'm just, there's certain things about it that I need to, you know, I need to know. I really probably need classes, you know. Um, but so I do it for people that really, it doesn't really matter. No. People that love you. That's right. No that matter what. That will not judge. That's if right. That tastes just great, or if, you know something's not quite right. And of course, there's many a flaws on this one. But um, that's kind of it. Just you know, I, it's for fun. So you know, if you start doing it for the public, it puts a lot more pressure well, on you. So that's just, true. Yeah. So I just kind of want to you know ease into it and um, you know just keep it as a hobby for now. And who knows, you know. Do you do the same cake base every time? Cake flavor, or are you? Well, I'm really just practicing. I mean, I love to do like the end fillings on the inside. A lot of people oh. don't like that one. This particular one is um, just a vanilla buttercream on mm -hmm. the bottom with a vanilla buttercream um, in the middle. The top layer is uh, vanilla buttercream with a raspberry. So, oh, so, um, That way you can kind of taste it and give me your honest opinion, because I need your honest opinion about, you know, how it tastes and, you know, could it be more moist, less moist, you know, um, more flavor, less flavor, too sweet. Some people don't like really sweet icing. I happen to love sweet icing. A lot of people Good. Don't. Me too. Um, but, you know, so just kind of give me your honest opinion. So I kind of do it for people that I know that will tell me, look, this is what you need to do to improve, you know. Um, so. I am blown away. And happy birthday two days late. <laughs> That's all right. I like it. I'm having birthdays for two weeks now. But you know, this is great. And anyone who has a hobby or something they enjoy should do like Robin and continue to work with it. And there are a lot of tutorials now on YouTube. Have you looked at any of those? Oh, absolutely. I stay on YouTube all the time. Oh, of course, Pinterest, you know, but mm -hmm. YouTube is a great, great way to learn things. And you know, everything I've done, I've just learned from YouTube on my own, mainly sitting down working with it. So you didn't go to classes at all? No, no. Not Strictly? At not at all. Gosh, there may be hope for me. I doubt it. Thank you so much, and I thank Welcome. you for Happy my birthday. present. Thank Perfect. you.